Whenever Biochem makes you scream, herbal team, and things seem hard or tough, and metabolites seem daunting, difficult or daft, and you think that you've had quite enough, just remember when prescribing the herbs that you're imbibing for all the funny ailments that there are. That secondary metabolites are also in these herbs. If you get what they can do, you will go far. There's terpenoids and alkaloids and phenolic compounds made up from carbon atoms most diverse. The resins, oils and saponins and bitters help your bile in our medicinal and plant-based universe. The terpenes found in peony, valerian and cleavers are ours we like to call volatile. They all have carbons 10, so they're monoterpenoid. They calm our nerves and often make us smile. Antimicrobial sesquiterpenes in hops and myrrh have 15 carbon atoms at their core. The ones with added lactones like Achillea and Inula are bitter but soothe your tongue and so much more. While stritopenes and saponins are like steroidal soap that help to clean your body of some muck. Like licorice, mullein, horsetail, golden rod and fenugreek, they'll regulate your hormones with some luck. There's alkaloids with nitrogen, which are the dodgy ones. They'll kill off insects and they'll kill off pain. Like lobelia, belladonna, coffee, nicotine and such. And nasty drugs like strychnine and cocaine. Hepatotoxic pyrolizidines, which hide in comfrey, or need to be administered with care. Although it's misreported, there is damage they can do, so of toxic side effects you'll be aware. And finally the phenols, which have compounds much like booze, the shikimic acid pathway which provides some amino acids such as phenol, alanine and tyrosine, and the stuff that is in aspirin here resides. There are lignins, lignins, flavonoids, and tannins oh so dry. There's anthroquinones, coumarins, and more. They're astringent, antifungal, and they're often good for hearts. They'll help live for bladder mucus things galore. So remember whilst you're sitting in that horrid old exam how amazing plant metabolites can be. And pray that inspiration comes upon you from this song, because it's ten times bloody worse than a and I was quite happy with that. Mm.